anyway, um, probably appropriate we're doing a lot of Mozart in this concert. We just, um, as you know, the orchestra and band students, several of us went on a trip to uh, Prague and Salzburg um, just recently, and one of the places we got to visit along our trip was Mozart's birthplace. So I got a chance to go see the home where he was born, and the piano composed a lot of his pieces on it. This, this concerto is one of many, many pieces he wrote. I mean, he wrote four horn concertos, what was it, two? Operas, he wrote 23 operas. Um, so you just heard selections from two of the many operas he wrote. Um, he wrote um, 18 masses. So you just heard one of 18, you know, one part of one of the 18 <coughs> op, um, masses he wrote. Just a huge body of work, and he died at like around age 35. So he died at a very young age with a large body of work that he had written. So it's very exciting to get a chance to hear a lot of his music. Um, we also had a chance to see, um, there's an instrument music museum in Salzburg, and they had some horns that were from this time period. It's really neat to know that um, the modern horn that, that Lucas will be playing on in just a minute here has valves on it, but a lot of the horns back at that time, if you want to play in different keys, you have to take a different piece of tube, metal tubing and stick it in the horn to make different pitches. So you played the key of F, you had to get an F horn with the F attachment. And, and it's had some really beautiful instruments you have to see when I was in Salzburg, some of the instruments from that time that probably would have even played maybe this piece on. It's very exciting. So anyway, um, I want to welcome Lucas Gallier, who is our home soloist for the next piece. <coughs> 